It's been a giving church and it can continue to be, but not in its current form. It's sandstone, it's fragile, it crumbles. Look at this. This is not unique, it's happening all over the United States. Fewer people are going to church, fewer people are giving to churches, and congregations all over this city are dealing with building issues. And they're serious building issues. And they are sapping the purpose of why we have a church in the first place. Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. We don't want to be evicted because we don't have, looking for a space in Manhattan is difficult. It, it is very, very important for us that this space remains as a sacred space that is not torn down. I understand that there are defects and they need to be repaired, but I believe also that if it would be um, renovated in such a way that it is safe, because I'm sure everybody's concern is probably about safety. Nobody wants to get hurt you know, sued or the like. And there's four floors of art spaces, rehearsal spaces, and theaters. Now, if we take that away and we replace it with a 10,000 square foot small space, we're displacing hundreds of artists that use this space every year. We are 100% opposed to that. So we are working to raise the money, but we want it to remain the building with repurposing. And I think around the country, if we can show this here, which I think we can, it's a good example of landmarking is important to our historic fabric of our communities. You can't be tearing down these structures everywhere. Thank you.